so today's video is going to be storylines I wish did not happen on the next step I made a video on storylines I wish had happened on the next step the next step winning regionals I know this sounds like an option opinion I feel like in season one regionals Elite's routine was bad. These are the reasons why Elite, their dance with the aeroplane was so much better than Stand Up. I didn't like Stand Up, I liked their dance. Because Michelle and Eldon's duet took up much of the dance, I didn't like the solo motion. I loved Elite's unison sections, there was so much energy, I loved the tricks. I loved what they did. I loved how the theme that you could see what the theme was. I thought the unison sets were good but the storyline didn't come through as much as I would have liked. The theme was Romeo and Juliet so what they should have done is have each side in each side in have both sides in two different coloured costumes rather than everyone looking different. And also I felt like everyone was dancing around Michelle and Alden. It wasn't the most polished, it felt messy, it felt like other people's moves were getting lost. It didn't really fit well together, it wasn't the most put together dance. Elite, their dance was so much more put together than the Next Steps dance. So it was clean, so that is why I think that. Next, instead of Giselle taking Riley's solo, I would have had Amanda do it. I don't know why Amanda was the alternate. She didn't deserve the alternate, and Amanda would do this amazing solo prove acro is not only one style. Next is, instead of Amanda being the alternate, I would have had Michelle still, but I also would have probably had Riley because Amanda's better than her. Like, I've had Michelle and Riley. as the alternates and Amanda would be in the main dance. I just feel like Amanda's better than alternate and Riley it's not quite as good. Like I know they probably have like similar moves but Amanda just has more like there's more like Amanda can do the I think it's called the ponche whereas I don't think I've ever seen Riley do that. I think it's called that, I'm not 100% sure, but... Next is the 0% Club shouldn't have happened because it, there was not enough episodes to go off it. It's not like the E-Girls where they were in every single episode and they had a storyline. I liked what they were trying to achieve, like these girls didn't have much confidence and... They were trying to become more confident, but I just don't think it worked. Like, it kind of just came and went and kind of came back at the end. And also the focus of the season was Riley, James and Alfie, so it was kind of a pointless story line. I liked what they were trying to achieve, it just didn't work. Like, they should have had a story time, but they didn't have enough screen time to make it work. Next one that shouldn't have happened is Ralphie. Riley should have just said to Elfie we should just stay friends because they're good friends like Riley can have more than one male friend but she doesn't need to cheat on James and I thought Riley and Elfie were better as friends I know. Also Elfie being a prince shouldn't have happened instead of Riley Instead of Alfie being a prince, he should have just been a dancer coming from a true pond Switzerland that ha that competes at internationals. Next one, Amy and Troy. That should not have happened. I would have liked to have seen it instead of that be Amy and Troy just stay friends or dance partners and have. Latroy and Sloan. I fully ship Latroy and Sloan, but I do not ship Amy and Latroy. 
Because Amy literally said at the dance we should do something about this chemistry. Latroy was kind of confused. So I can, I can see why. Next shouldn't have happened is Riley and James breaking up so many times it should not have happened. Basically James cheated on Riley in season 2. Not so okay but they got back together. James proved he really cared about Riley and in season 4 Riley cheated on James. I know she went to London but I don't think she proved she cared about James. Should have ended at season 3 or season 4. In season 3, Alden should not have just been given the male soloist without having to audition. All the male dancers should have had a chance to audition for the male soloist spot. Because I was kind of shocked when I saw that because it's like I thought they always hold auditions for this. I thought they always hold auditions, like they should hold auditions because it's the fairest thing to do. Same with Riley. Shouldn't have been given the female soloist spot without having to audition. All female dancers should have had the chance to audition. No, as much as he was good dance captain, I think. Him and Rochelle should have been co-captains. It would have been nice to see because Rochelle's wanted to be dance captain. And Noah's also a good dance captain. And they both really complement each other. They work well together and they play to each other's strengths nicely. Another thing is, the Noah and Rochelle episode should have been brought up enough. I feel like that shouldn't have happened without the build up. Because Noah hadn't even spoke to Rochelle for a long time. Noah and Rochelle needed to have more conversations like... Rochelle went to the hospital to see Noah, but Noah didn't go to the hospital to see Rochelle. Noah should have done that. Next is Summer and the Power Cut. I don't think it was realistic for Summer to turn out the power to a building because it's just not realistic. Instead I'd have a power cut and everyone trying to figure it out with no good cop, bad cop. Because that was also not really realistic. Also it was a bit of a babyish storyline. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and I will see you in another video. Bye.